What up guys? So today I've got a really dope day planned. Basically, I'm actually going to Ras Khaimah to see Omran because Omran is there with his family, Faid, and I really miss him. So I was like to him, listen, I'm going to come down to Ras Khaimah, chill with you for a bit. He was like, I'm down. And then also, I'm actually going to be stopping along the way in Dubai to meet these um, YouTubers called Hannah and Leon. They're like these really nice people. We've been like having back and forth communication. And the, the problem is, is that we don't live in the same country. But they're on holiday currently at the moment in Dubai. So I was like to them, listen, along the way, why don't I stop over, come say hi. And they were like, you know what, we're down. So that's what we're going to be doing. I'm going to be going to the Mall of Emirates, probably going to be chilling with them a bit. And then I also found out just now while I was on the phone that Lyndon's actually going to meet up with them. So I'm going to be seeing Lyndon, two new YouTuber friends, and then Omran as well. So today's going to be a pretty dope day. Um, but I don't want to be late, so I'm going to make my way now to the car. And I'll see you guys along the way. a bit of a change of plans I'm still heading to Mall of Emirates to meet up with Lyndon but Hassan just messaged me and said that he's gonna be tagging along too so I kind of diverted my route to go pick him up so I'm on the way there now hopefully I'm able to find his place because man Dubai is so difficult to find places like if you don't know exactly where you're going it, it's just so difficult also shout out to Hassan because he recently hit 1k and I'm, man I'm so proud of him like man I, I, li I like seeing my friends succeed um, but yeah I'll leave a link to his channel in the description so please go give him some more love Let's try and get him to 2k now. Okay, so I somehow end up in the middle of a desert. Pretty sure Hassan's house is somewhere over there. How the hell do I get there? No! More dirt road! Look, how, how do you get on that road? I want to be on that road. You see where the car is on? Help me. Help me! Where are you going? Help me! Where are you going? Help me! Yes, back on road where my car can actually drive. I know it's one of these villas, but how do I enter? Where's the entrance? Alright, so I've literally been driving around for like 10 minutes and I just, it's just fences. Where the hell is the entrance? Seriously, Hassan, like, how do I enter your complex? Like, why is Dubai so freaking difficult? How would that be so easy? Yes, we found it! Oh my god, that was literally, guys, that was coming up to about 45 minutes. Like, that was, that's ridiculous. I see him! There he is! Ooh, I like the khakis. With the black t-shirt, we're, <laughs> we're pretty much matching today. Oh yeah, legit. Yeah, we're wearing, I'm wearing black, I'm wearing sort of like khaki colored shorts. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we're running late now, so I'm gonna hop back on the road and make my way. By the way, your house is a maze. Your house is a literal you, maze. Explain, you, <laughs> literally, I felt like I was the maze runner just now. Like, da -da 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 -da. I don't know what happened. No one ever takes the entrance you took. Yeah? I don't know how you got there. I don't know which map service. I'm gonna show you the footage of where I was, okay? Sure. Do you remember how last time in the vlogs, guys, how I was showing um, these guys in Hassan's vlog, I was like, look, these are parking spaces. You never see them? So over here, we've got endless amount of car spaces. I'm showing you this because you don't have this in Dubai. This is what I'm talking about. We've entered Mall of Emirates. It's been about five minutes now, and there's literally no spaces to the point where Linden has now called us and told us, by the way, there's like literally no parking here. What kind of mall has no parking? Hi right, guys, guys. What kind of mall? This is a massive mall and there's so many spaces, but it is that flipping, I don't know what the word is, congested. It's so congested of a mall that there's no spaces. He and caught us off guard, around. he caught us off guard. Go to Abu Dhabi right now, see how many spaces there are. Thousands, thousands of spaces. He's lying. This is why Abu Dhabi's better, I'm just, I'm just saying. So we just arrived in Mall of Emirates. Um, how long was that, three and a half hours to find parking? But three and a half, four hours? Yeah, four hours to find parking. But in all seriousness, it took us like literally like 15 minutes to find parking. We got lucky, is, we got actually lucky. Yeah, we got lucky. We got I saw a, a guy turning and I was like, he just saw, a family, just turned. He saw a family leaving and he turned so fast that we got lucky. We got really yeah, lucky. I was like, nah, mate, I'm taking that space because I'm already late because, you know, Dubai. So I was like, I, I don't want to take the piss anymore because I hate being late. Something about me, if you guys don't know this. I hate being late. What's up, guys? What's up, bro? Leon, yeah? Pleased to meet you, Leon. Hi, Hannah, how are you? So kind of you to wait for us. So kind. So kind, guys. And look at what is that? Food. And what are we doing? We're eating air. Look. Um, so tasty. Um, do you want some air with me? Here you go, have some air. I've had enough. Okay. You're on a diet, yeah? Man, they're so synchronized. <laughs> I just finished my Shake Shack burger. I don't, like, I just, I don't really like, I don't hate Shake Shack. I just don't find it that great. Like everyone loves it, but I find it okay. Like the place that I went to with M. Khan called the, the burger joint. Now that, 
That was a good burger. I mean, you need to try that, by the way, in the future. Uh, like, next time you come to Abu Dhabi, Abu Dhabi yeah. you have to try that burger. Um, but right now, we've actually changed the plans. So we're going to actually head to Dubai Mall with all the gang, and we're going to go chill with Thogan for a bit and smuck about in Dubai Mall. Um, but yeah, so right now we're heading to the car and make our way to Burj Khalifa. By the way, I just want to say, do you know how happy I am that I can just park in your place? Because the malls are crazy busy today. Really? It literally took us like 25 minutes to park in one of them. Oh, oh. Bring it in, bring it in, bro. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Hey, bro, how are you doing? You good? I'm good, yeah. I really like your top, by the way. Thank you. All black on black. Black on black, geez. All right, guys, so we met up with the, the gang, and they want to go upstairs to like the 20, 120 something third floor to see the lounge because they never seen it, Hannah and Leon. So, because you only allow three guests up at a time, we were like, me and Hassan were like, you know, we'll take one for the team. You know, we'll be, we'll as be, always do, as we <laughs> But I was like, no, no, we've already seen it, you guys should go, it'd be cool, we vlog footage. So we're like, we're gonna go and muck about, chill in the South Fountain, which I've actually never seen before, so I'm glad we decided this. And then we're gonna actually go on a sneaky adventure and go through the car park and see if we can find any Lamborghinis. I just want to say guys, this right here is one of my all time favorite cars and all I want to do is I literally just want to touch it. I'm not going to because you can't disrespect someone like that, especially because it's not my car but I, just, I, just, I, just, I want to touch it so bad. I really want to touch it. I can't though, I can't. I have to respect someone else's property. I just, oh, such a good car. You tried to hide from us, you cheeky little sod. McLaren LP4, you tried to hide from us, you beautiful little McLaren. How did you try and hide from us? But just look how beautiful this car is, man. Seriously guys, if any of you have luxurious cars and you wanna like leave them in a car park collecting dust, feel free to donate them to me at karimchidonateacar.co.uk and I'll gladly take them on board for you. I'll look after them, I'll give them a bubble bath every day, I'll kiss them goodnight, and I'll even read them a bedtime story because these cars deserve to be cherished. Guys, another McLaren. I'm in car heaven right now, and this one's dirty as well. What is going on with McLaren owners? This is so dirty. How can you treat your McLaren like this? So you don't deserve it. No, no, give me the keys, give me the keys. Like I said, Krimchi adopts your car, .co.uk. Hook me up with this car. I need to adopt it, I need to look after it. It needs to be treated well. I know someone else's car, but I'm sorry, you should not mistreat that car like that. It should not be just cooped up in a bloody garage collecting dust. It should be treated with respect, it should be detailed, it should be cleaned, it should be washed, and it should be kissed every single night because you don't know how lucky you are to have that car. All right, so I just left the gang and started saying goodbye, but hopefully I'll be meeting up with them later. I'm not 100% sure. Right now, I just met up with them once. Hey, what up, bro? He's on the phone, he's on the phone, sorry. All right, guys, so I'm going about to have some dinner with some of Omran's family. Um, a lot of them don't want to be in vlog, obviously, privacy reasons, so I'm gonna eat the food and then I'll give you a review afterwards, okay? Yeah. All right, guys, we just left the sushi place we ate at, which was called Mango Sushi in Dubai Mall. That place was amazing. How good was the food, bro? So good. Like, I'm not the world's biggest sushi fan, but that was good sushi, like, proper good sushi. So, if you guys want sushi, you're in the Dubai area, check them out. Mango Sushi, really good. This is literally the perfect book for you. You should buy this. Okay, okay. Alright, so I just left Omran and the guys, they're heading back to Ras Khaimah. But it's like super late now and I've got work tomorrow. So I went to go collect my car and the lovely Thogan saved me. Because the lady, she wouldn't want to, she didn't want to let me go through. She was like, you're not allowed through. I was like, but my brother lives in Borja Khalifa. <laughs> she was like, she's like, nah, I need him to come. So I had to make the poor guy come all the way inside Dubai Mall to let me in. Uh, but yeah, I'm just gonna quickly grab a drink, say goodbye to Thurgan, make my way to Abu Dhabi. Hi guys, so I just picked up a Lipton iced tea peach, as I always do. It's my second favorite tourist to drink. And uh, I'm waiting for my car to come. I'm gonna head back to Abu Dhabi. Uh, shout out to Thurgan again. Saving me from Dubai Mall. Free Karimchi. Thurgan's food is here, so he's gonna go upstairs and eat. He's gonna ditch me for food. I'm joking, I told him to go, because cold food is the worst. So, see you later, bro. See you later, bro. Bring it in. All right, take it easy, man. See you soon, shall yeah? Take it easy. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.
Hi right, guys, so I just arrived home now. Um, I had an absolutely amazing day meeting all like the YouTube gang and all of the like peeps from Dubai. I had a great, great time. I was as well, I had an amazing sushi meal than one. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna hit the hay now because I've got work tomorrow. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, give it a massive, massive thumbs up. If you're new, please hit that subscribe button down below. And I'll see you guys very soon. Kerenchi out.